Hey there everyone, you watch TC's World and I'm your host Tim. And today, I'm at a really interesting place in Rhode Island. Today I'm at the site of one of America's worst nuclear disasters here in Rhode Island, Wood River Junction, down this road here. At the end of this road was a facility called United Nuclear Corporation. And today, we're gonna go see what's, uh, if there's anything left, if we can find any old foundations. I did find an old picture online, so I'll post that to show what the facility looked like. It's not a very good one, but it's the only one I could find. So now I'm standing at the site of the old United Nuclear Corp building in Wood River Junction, Rhode Island. Opened in 1963, closed in 1981, was the site of Amer one of America's Worst nuclear accidents in 1964. A man named Robert E. Peabody. He was processing nuclear waste. That's what they did at this facility. They processed it, separated out the good elements so they could use them to make new fuel rods. He was processing what he thought was low level waste, but it was high level waste because the containers were improperly marked and the mix went critical on him when he combined it into a mixer and it blew up coating the building room he was in and coating him with radioactive material 20 times the lethal dose killed him in 49 hours and uh, there's a few other people that ended up with radiation poisoning as a result the ambulance in which they used to bring him to the hospital had to be destroyed because it was highly radioactive afterwards and uh, he did not make it he died in 49 hours unfortunately and uh, it's a very sad story but that all happened right here, right here in Rhode Island, Wood River Junction, at this site that I'm now standing on. There's nothing left here today. I have a hard time even finding any chunks of concrete or any chunks of asphalt on the ground. I have a picture from an aerial survey in 1979, which I'll post on this video as well, so you can see what the facility looked like. This site was closed to the public until 2016 when it was finally reopened and turned into conservation land. It was deemed safe, no radiation above background levels in 2011. And uh, not that I trust the government, but I'm out here checking out the spot. Wandering around this site where the old nuclear United New Corporation facility sat. I'm very close to where the buildings would have stood here. There's nothing here nowadays. It's hard to find even chunks of concrete, although there's some pieces here. Piece of concrete here. Piece of concrete here. So exploring this site, most of what I find is just these little chunks of asphalt left. Did find some couple chunks of concrete. But it's mostly just these chunks of asphalt all that kind of give you an idea that there was something here and uh, they seem to keep this pretty mowed down because it's pretty easy to walk through here despite it looking like a jungle so I'm wandering around the site here of the old United Nuclear Corporation building and I found some of the old fencing which were probably around this facility when it was still closed off this is about the only real solid piece of concrete that I've found so far that's looks uh, like a foundational piece and uh, wandering towards an interesting thing I've seen on satellite off in these trees a little bit so keep wandering around a little bit see if I can find any evidence of the old facility so far this concrete here and the road and the parking area are about the only spots that are still intact they've pretty much erased this thing from existence altogether did a pretty good job of that but they probably had to decontaminate the site which means they probably hauled all this stuff out of here or buried it deep into the ground to make sure the radiation doesn't get out, if there is any. So one thing I did find, this is a kind of an odd looking structure on the satellite, so I bushwhacked my way in here. It's a big pit here, much deeper than the rest of the site, and it's filled with all kinds of debris. Um, not really sure why this is here, what this is for. I don't know if this is a burial site for something, 
we're not going to stick around here very long uh, go back out to the main area but I had to bushwhack my way through all this stuff to get out here and there's a big berm right here I am very curious what this was it's a big berm all the way around this thing I don't know if this is an old burial pit what this thing was Hard to know what any of this stuff was. But it's definitely interesting. So I've done a pretty thorough ex exploration of the site here where United Nuclear Corp, the Wood River Junction, Rhode Island, would have sat where it was. And uh, talked about that sad story about Robert Peabody. And uh, there's not much left of this, uh, this facility. But it's an interesting place to come out and check it out. It's still pretty wide open. Just behind this tree line here was that really weird imprint I found. Hole dug in the ground. No idea what's there. Could be something there. Who knows? Uh, could be something. Who knows what is buried on this property, really. But uh, it's been fun. Probably going to play around a little bit more, explore a little bit more. Walk the trails that are here. But... Uh, if you've enjoyed this video, click like and subscribe. Until next time.